Hello everybody and welcome to FB CAD CAM tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how to move an object using free basic. So our goal for today is we need to move a circle by pressing the up, down, left and right button on our keyboard. So in this video, I already put the codes that we needed for creating a circle. If you missed to watch the previous tutorial about creating a line and circle, just click the link in the description below. So to create a movement, we must type at the top of our code. Hashtag include once. Then between the double quotes, type fbgfx.bi. Include once means it is a preprocessor statement to include contents of another source file, which is the fbgfx.bi. Also, the fbgfx.bi means it is a free basic graphics library constants that define the scan codes of all the keys on your keyboard. Next is we need to declare another variable by typing dim as integer speed is equal to 3. We declare a speed because we need to know how fast the movement of our object. Next is we need to declare a do loop before and after the code of the circle object. Then after the do, press enter. Then inside the do loop, we also need to declare the if statement by typing if mold key another brackets. Then inside type fb that sc underscore up. Then press enter so multi key means it is a function which will detect the status of any key in our keyboard determined by scan codes then also type inside the if statement the circle x circle y minus equals speed this code shows the process and also the direction to move our circle so as you can see in this image, it shows the positive and the negative direction in our screen. That's why I declare negative of my code to move our circle to up. And let's run the program and see what happens. When you press the up keyboard, it moves up. To make our circle move literally, we need to declare between the circle code by typing screen lock cls then screen unlock screen lock means it locks automatic refresh in working page frame buffer cls means clear the screen in both text modes and graphic modes so screen unlock means we unlock the current work page by calling our screen lock and lets the system start updating the screen regularly and then let's run the program again so as you can see the output the circle is moving up on our screen when I press the up key button If we want to add the movement like down, left, and right, just copy the code of our if statement, then press enter after the end if, then paste it, then change the scan code from up to down. change this also from negative to positive the same thing as the left and right
change the circle Y into circle X same thing as the right and then let's run the program again so as you can see the output our circle moves freely by pressing the up down left and right button key so that's how we create a movement of our circle I hope you enjoy and learn a lot in this video leave a like share and subscribe to our youtube channel and i'll see you in the next tutorial